Getting your mind right. Getting your mind right starts with identifying your why. Identifying your why means that you must have a clear understanding of the reason you want to become a real estate investor. Money can't be the only reason why you want to become an investor. The obstacles and headaches will eventually outweigh the financial benefits. Your why is that deep, personal, inner drive that goes beyond the material and speaks to the core of who you are. It's an extremely personal reason and will often evolve as you grow personally and professionally. Identifying your why early on will help you develop the mental foundation that's needed to be successful in this business. Success in real estate investing begins and ends with your mind. Market conditions and opportunities will always change but you must maintain a sound mental philosophy and toughness. Despite setbacks, disappointments and unexpected occurrences your outlook must remain steadfast and resolute. This business will throw you unexpected curveballs daily. From not getting an offer accepted on that property you wanted, to an investor backing out at the last minute. From an unexpected drop in your credit score causing you to lose your financing, to underestimating repair costs on a rehab. From unreliable contractors that don't show up for work, to losing money on a flip. There will be times during your real estate investing career that you will want to quit. My advice is, don't quit. This is the time you must bear down and keep moving forward. Here are some mental strategies to adopt and potential roadblocks to look out for. No days off. There are no days off when you're aiming to be successful at real estate investing. You must approach each day with a clear plan of attack and an unwavering determination to make the most of each day. You have to set goals while eliminating distractions and obstacles aimed at stopping you from achieving your goals. The business moves too fast and a potential opportunity can be lost if you're not on your A-game each day. We are all human so there will be days that life happens. It's important for you to create and implement systems that will help you efficiently run your business. Keep focused on your goals and never quit. There will be competing priorities, unforeseen occurrences, and setbacks during your real estate journey. These are unavoidable. Despite these challenges, you must remain committed to achieving your goal. Leaning on your why during these tough times is critical. Developing clear and attainable goals will help you identify what tasks you need to focus your attention on. With that said, the most important thing to remember is to never quit. If real estate investing was easy then everyone would be successful at it. Endure the challenges, learn from your mistakes and keep pushing ahead. Pull the trigger. There's a spectrum of decision making. The left spectrum involves making decisions without any information. The right spectrum requires you to always need more information, resulting in you never taking action. It's natural to be hesitant about taking action when you're lacking confidence or if you feel like you don't have all the answers. If you're waiting to know everything about real estate investing before embarking upon your first deal then I have news for you, you'll be waiting forever. The truth is that no one knows everything about real estate investing. The subject is too vast and there are countless ways to become a real estate investor. If you're waiting to become an expert before you begin investing then you'll be waiting forever. You have to avoid the paralysis of analysis at all costs. Don't get so consumed with the desire to know everything before investing in real estate. I'm not advocating recklessness and it's necessary to perform your due diligence. However, once you have reasonably vetted a potential opportunity, pull the trigger. Everyone has experienced a loss or setback while investing in real estate. Setbacks are an unavoidable part of the process, but it's this experience that proves to be your best teacher. Your development as a real estate investor will be aided by your mistakes and failures, so get in the game, making excuses. Stop making excuses why you can't become a real estate investor. Excuses are monuments of nothingness and they build bridges to nowhere. Stop convincing yourself about all the reasons you can't do it and just give yourself one reason why you can. Eliminate negative energy and people that are feeding you false rationale as to why you shouldn't become a real estate investor. Don't feel that you have to convince others or justify your decision. Give yourself permission to be great. Eliminate your fear. The very thing that you're afraid of is the one thing you will need in order to be successful. Failure. There's no way to become successful without failing. You must realize that failure brings education, confidence, growth, knowledge and opportunity. Being momentarily scared is natural but succumbing to fear is an unnatural form of bondage. We were not created to be fearful. Look past your present fearful circumstances and look towards the hope of the future you want. You must push past the barriers of fear and uncertainties. They only exist to deter you from something great that is on the other side. Commit to continuous learning. You must commit to a life of continuous learning and education in order to be successful as a real estate investor. The speed at which the industry changes is rapid and not keeping up could result in a severe financial loss. 
This commitment isn't optional but is a requirement for successful participation in this profession. Here are some methods you can use to gain knowledge and to keep yourself on top of things. 1. Attend a real estate related class. 2. Find a mentor. 3. Attend a seminar. 4. Network with other real estate investors. And 5. Read books and blogs.